this man came out and said the Artem Harder Union is gonna start running. I know he's gonna start running. This I know he's gonna start running. What did he say? Hey. Oh. I know he's gonna start running. Boy, ain't no fucking way, boy. Boy, ain't no way, boy. Boy, ain't no way, boy. If I tell you I'm good, probably you will say I'm boasting. If I tell you I'm no good, you know one line. <laughs> Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Dr. PG and praise God to get money back for another YouTube video. Bang, your man. Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. I don't know what time it is. The doctor's in the house. Check this out, man. So, you know that Shakur Stevenson, you know, he's a great fighter. He has a fight coming up against Artem Hunter Union on uh, July 6th, right? This weekend, this Saturday, you know, good Lord willing. But, you know, there's a couple knocks on, on Shakur Stevenson, but it's never really about his fighting. You know, he's, he's really a boxing phenom. He's really a beast. Bullshit! Bullshit! And, um, you know, future pound for pound fighter. But the big knock on him is that his he, he, he talks too much on social media. His social media presence is, is, <laughs> is bigger than his actual presence in the ring. You know what I'm saying? Especially with his fighting style. You know, I don't mind his fighting style. But, you know, his last fight against Edward De Los Santos, a lot of people said he was running. Shakur Stevenson, look, they're, they're not sent up. And he swears it's perfectly fine now. But he told us he was going to unveil. Boring. Man, which is not really the full truth, you know. Edward De La Santos, he's a big puncher in that outfit, and he didn't really bring the fight to Shakur like he was supposed to, or like people thought, you know. But people don't really care about that because he's not the star, right? So Shakur's a star, so he gets the majority of the flack, which which makes sense, you know. But then Shakur Stevenson, you know, on an episode of Real Time by Top Rank, which is like a bootleg twenty four seven, yeah, <laughs> definitely has some work to do right there in the storytelling. But you know, it, it did what it did. But it was a little short segment on Shakur trying to get people more involved with him and more, uh, more, more, more. More, more into the fight or the upcoming fight um, that's about to happen. And, you know, on that episode, man, Shakur Stevenson, he comes out and says <laughs> the last thing he should say. <laughs> I can't make this up, man. This man, Shakur Stevenson, after all the, 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 the negativity that's around it, out of all the trash talk people give him about running, this man came out and said the Artem Harder Union is going to start running. I know he's going to start running this I know he's gonna start running. What did he say? Hey. Oh. I know he's gonna start running. <laughs> bro, come, come on, come on, bro. Your awareness has to be. <laughs> I don't know. He, like, he had to be trolling. But you see his face. He's, he's being serious. Like, that's the last thing you could accuse people of right now. It, it, it's running, bro. That's the last thing you should say. That's the last thing you should come out your mouth, man. You shouldn't even say. You should just stop at R. You shouldn't even finish the whole word. You know what I'm saying? The last thing you want to do is make accusations about somebody else and, and, and running. You know? when that's what you're accused of doing. You know, whether you whether it's true or not, like I said, I think that he's partially right. You know, I think he's going to put the pressure on Artem Honey Union and he's going he's gonna, to, well, he should dominate the fight. You know, I thought Tia was going to dominate Steve Clark too. We saw what happened with there. But uh, yeah, he should look good in this fight. I think he will look good in this fight. But you can't, come on, man. You got to have some better... <laughs> You got to be more aware of your current situation, man. Everybody's accused you of running. You cannot tell, say that anybody else in life runs. I don't even care if you see a jogger running by you. Don't say that they moving fast or something. Don't say that they running. You know what I'm saying? Say they jogging, sprinting. <laughs> but, yeah. And, and then the other knock on him is that, of course, you know, he was talking trash about Frank Martin, saying that he's not a good quality opponent for Tank or anybody else. And then, you know, the guy that he's fighting in the Artem Honey Union, Harvard Union, excuse me, the only person that... Artem lost to is Frank the Ghost Martin. So yeah. it's just, you know, that's why a lot of people give him a lot of negative energy and criticism, but, you know, and he sees it as hate. And yes, a lot of people are hating. There's a lot of people that are trolls and they just talk on the side of their neck. They haven't accomplished anything in life, but they just want to point point fingers at, at, at somebody doing better than them or something like that. But a lot of people are actually giving you give it constructive criticism too, you know, and when you when people get annoyed by Shakur Stevenson, it's because of things like this, you know what I'm saying? He's a key. He, he His last fight against Edward De La Santos, you know, you're judged as a fighter by your last fight, you know, it looked like he was running, you know, um, and, and didn't want to engage. And then, you know, he criticized Frank Martin for not being a high caliber opponent. But then the guy that you're fighting right now, only has one loss, and that loss came to Frank the Ghost Martin. So it just seems very contradictory, man. You got to have a little bit more awareness, my brother. He got to take like a, you know, PR clash or something. But I can help him out with that. You know what I'm talking about? But yeah, I think Shakur Stevenson will look phenomenal in his next fight against Arthur Honey. I do, I do anticipate him to look great, and I do think he's gonna he's gonna quiet some of the doubters, man. Is he though? He has to. He has to quiet some of the doubters. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, that's all I wanted to talk about, man. <laughs> 
I just thought it was funny, man. I appreciate y'all rocking me as always. Remember, with God, we can do anything without God, we're nothing. Y'all be easy. Take care. The doctor's out. Peace. From the hood to college, both worlds, they had to meet. Six degrees between us, so cold, we're about to freeze. But we're Florida boys, hot takes, we bring the heat. We're moving the culture, the engineers to the streets.